What is going on, everybody? Welcome back to Mr. Joe's Baseball Show. We got another game of the Netplay Classic today. This time, the final game of the regular season of the Netplay Classic. It's me versus Legendary Bolt. If you remember the last game, I know it was a while ago. We went to extra innings. It was a great time. This time, we got another great game for you. Uh, again, same as last video. I am doing this after the fact because I recorded these back to back. And my audio was messed up for both games so we're getting the post commentary here let's get into this game i am of course the wario garlics or whatever their name is and both is the i believe it's the mario heroes not exactly sure mario heroes there it is so this is the final game of the classic i hope you guys have enjoyed it so far we um i believe we have clinched playoffs at this point so uh whether we win or lose we will be finishing in the top four, which gives you a playoff spot. So, yeah, we're feeling pretty good. Uh, we'll definitely have the playoffs coming up next, so you guys uh, can look forward to that. I believe I am slated to play either Remke. No, I think, I, I think I'm think i locked on, uh, on Boomerang Bro for playoffs because we're either both finishing 6-4 and four or I'm finishing 7-3. and three, So we'll find out after this game. Obviously, I am, uh, I am the Wario team, so... Quick start, you know, Madge getting out like that, and then Petey lining out on the low tragedy. Pretty unlucky, but, um, you know, I don't hate my odds against this team. I think I think my team's super solid. I really enjoy my team. Uh, I like the top of the lineup a lot, even though I didn't produce with it there, but either way. Also, if you guys notice, I'm in a different, uh, in a different spot. It's a different, out, uh, different background, so check that out. Isn't that pretty cool? Unlucky on that line out to center. Uh, I also didn't shave in a while. What do you guys think? Can't really grow a beard. What do you guys think of the facial hair? Comment down below, yes or no? Pog or nah on the facial hair? All right, here we are, bottom of the first. I think uh, probably just a quick delay. Um, and I don't think that was pitch clock. I think I may have actually just thrown that pitch. Not entirely sure, but you know, whatever. All right, leadoff single, not that big of a deal. Uh, basically, I don't think Bolt's team is very good. Oh, he bobbled, of course. I wonder if I would have had him going to second and then first there. What do you guys think? I could have thrown to second. I, I went for, like, the tag, like what I'm going to do here. <laughs> so, like, it ultimately didn't matter. But, uh, I don't know. Because uh, he, he stopped, which which is definitely, like, the right move there. Uh, if it's like a guaranteed double play ball, obviously they could bobble like I did, but hedging your bets, you're better off stopping. Uh, because the reason I, th I say it's better off is because, uh, one, it either forces a throw, and when, which gives time, more time for your runner going to first, or sometimes it even just, you know, ra rarely against, like, better players, but sometimes it just kind of tosses their brain in the blender, and, uh, they mess up a throw somehow. So that's, that's you know, always something that can happen. So, you know, interesting stuff. But it's also, it could be risky because, as you saw there, he probably would have been safe at second had he not, uh, had he not stopped. And now, obviously, I would have, um, I would have just thrown to first and gotten the out there, but he'd have a runner in scoring position, which is definitely better. So pretty uneventful first two innings for, uh, for our boys here. And he's leading off with Boomer, I believe. Yeah, Boomerang, bro. So we'll see what he can do here. We will see. I um, I, I don't like this. I don't like the slap hit at all. I think, like, sure, Boomerang slap hit occasionally lands for singles, but, like, just try to hit a home run. I understand that you have your captain coming up and maybe you want to get a runner on for that, but just if you hit a home run with Boomer, like, you get a run, first of all, and also, like, uh, Boomerang, bro... Uh, I understand he's a little less power, but if you if you don't run, awesome. If not, like, you still have Mario with one out. You can still burn a star there. I honestly would have burned a star there if I were him with Mario, with Boo coming up. You know, maybe you get a double with Mario, Boo can score him from second, something like that. Uh, I don't remember if it was a star chance or not, but if it was, I definitely would have gone for it. You know, you get the star for star. Uh, but, you know, not my team, not my problem. However, my problem is, in fact, baby Mario here. This guy drives me through he drives me up a wall, man. Drives me up an absolute wall. And that's why. Character sucks. He's so bad, dude. 
absolutely terrible. All right, Magikoopa. I like Madge a lot. Uh, I think I think Magikoopa might be my favorite character to play with. I I, I think uh, the slap hits nice. The star hits nice. Maybe maybe second only to Donkey Kong. I like DK a lot. Plus, like they're fielding both characters is is absolutely immaculate. Madge, DK, Mario. Those are those are my boys. And that's um. You know, not what you're looking for with PD, but actually, uh, kind of a lucky scenario getting low trajectory there. Because if I had gotten, uh, if I'd gotten the high trage, it would have been a fly out to Bowser Jr. And that one just sneaks by Paratroopa. Oh no! And I was talking about it in the last video I put up. This is a good scenario for Wario because you have a chance at the grander. You got bases loaded. Put the ball in the air. You get a sack fly. It's honestly a great scenario. You just gotta hit the ball. And I do. Very nice stuff. And that's, you know what, we take those any day. You take the RBI single, you keep the lineup moving, and now you get your next guy up in Yellowfellow, who has been so clean for us lately. So clean. Unfortunately, going to ground it to a double play, though. But he's been great. And I was off by a frame there. One frame earlier, that's a nice RBI single, so you can't complain too much. Uh, I did put a run across, but honestly, would have liked a little bit more. Uh, but also this part of this part of the lineup, you're pretty happy to see. Uh, kind of a couple of really bad characters back to back. Oh boy, guys, my Chipotle's here. A bit of behind the scenes. I just ordered lunch, and now we're halfway through the video. So that means that I'm gonna pause and go get it, so it doesn't have to sit outside. All right, we're back. Chipotle acquired. Let's get back into the video. Uh, I'm not giving up a hit to Paratroopa here. All right, I lied. I give up a, a hit to Paratroopa. That sucks. It sucks giving up, like, a star against one of the worst hitters on the team. That's the bottom of the lineup, so now it wraps to, I think, it's either two or three bones into BJ. I think it's two. Um, which, you know, I don't love it. I, I honestly don't like both team very much. And Magic Koopa still nice. Stays freaking nice, man. But yeah, I don't know. I don't love both team. It's not so bad, but it could be better, I think. All right, here we go, Shy Guy. I think that's... Honestly, I, I think it's worth investing one star here, but I don't really think it's worth two because... Um, like, in a scenario like this, I have Shy Guy into Shy Guy, I think into Peach into Baby Mario, something like that. So, like, getting on with one star for Shy Guy is pretty nice. You know, you set up, set up maybe a chemistry thing or just, like, you know, you go slappies. But it's not worth two because this isn't the part of my lineup I'm looking to produce with. I may as well... Hold on to the stars for Magikoopa. Nice little hit by pitch there. Lean into that one. But may as well stay, save the stars for Magikoopa. Uh, I think a better shortstop makes that with ease. But, you know, Bones, not a good shortstop. So, it, it kind of... It, it's kind of hard to justify using multiple stars on your six hitter. So, I don't know. Uh, but, but now, since I, I, I've got four stars bases loaded for Magikoopa, this is where we crack things open, baby. This is where this is where the, the the money is made. A nice star from Madge, just like that, it's gonna bring across two runs, and that's a three zero lead. Now you got PD up. Now you got Waluigi on deck. Like this is what the team was built for. I mean, I don't like the bottom of my lineup, but if you get them on, you get them on. Am I right? Now this is a tough situation because like, do you walk or pitch? Ends up pitching. Uh, might have been one of those like I might walk you type of deals where he like pitches really far inside. Uh. But I, I grabbed it and, of course, got low tragedy again with PD. That's like the second time in a row, man. Second time in a row. But it is what it is. Going for the steal, it was kind of um, it was a hit-and-run situation. You know, maybe I can get PD to third on an ice hit from Walu. Uh, I'm probably not going to... Yeah, not, not, I'm not really going to try it again. Uh, unfortunately, if I had tried it, I probably wouldn't have... Uh, oh, never mind. All right. I, I Honestly... If I had stolen, maybe I end up safe on both bases if he throws a second still. Oh, what a hit from Wario. That's not going to get down. Damn, nice play from BJ. Okay. It looked like it was low enough, but, you know, four run fourth, four in the fourth. You like that. That's what you like to see. So, here we are, bottom of the fourth. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed the Netplay Classic, right? Because I had a lot of fun playing in it. It was a good time, you know. This isn't it, of course. There's, I'm gonna have one more video at least. Um, I don't know if I'm gonna do like a whole like a like a playoff kind of like like condensed video or if I upload all the games. What do you guys think? You, you want the games uploaded individually? You want like a condensed uh, 
kind of like a highlights, like a rewatch, like I, I, a recap kind of thing where like I show the important parts. Oh, Walu, what a play. What a freaking play from Walu. What do you guys think? Do you like a condensed version where I commentate over it? Something like that. I don't know. I think we got him here. Yeah. That's a great double play. Waluigi coming off the bag for that. Um, a lot of characters get glitched in that situation. If you're not familiar with that. Uh, they'll kind of stay in the bag and they won't grab it. Since Walu's so wide, uh, he, he reaches down for that. Really, really good benefit of the character. So, um, yeah, what do you think? I, I can upload the games individually. Probably in a style like this because I was trying to focus more during the playoffs. So I definitely, um, uh, I, I like, I wasn't, I wasn't looking to commentate them. Like these games I kind of just, was just playing. Uh, or I could do like a recap video where I kind of condense it down, like all, maybe each playoff series or like the whole playoffs into, you know, a 15, 20 minute video, something like that. And then I give you a, like a voiceover on it and kind of walk you through it. Uh, I could do either one. What do you, what do you guys think? It'll probably come out next week. I haven't been that consistent with content lately, but uh, starting to get back into the groove of things. So that's why you got the video yesterday. You're getting another video today, back to back, baby. Uh, and then we're gonna have some other stuff coming up soon. So I'm excited. Nice hit from Peach. Really nice hit from Peach. We yeah, no, up been really, really uh, just a just a Mr. Joe life update. Been really busy, especially with like, uh, uh, especially with Dinger City stuff lately. We're uh, we're doing the Dinger City playoffs right now. That's actually starting up. Uh, next week on monday uh and then we we you know we're doing our streams and everything like that so things have been things have been a little hectic for uh for your boy here but we're getting back in the groove net play classic games are getting put out it's the last game of the season so we're almost all caught up yeah so we're, we're feeling good that play classic isn't even over yet so you know what if i get out all all of these videos before the playoffs even conclude then we're feeling good you know we're feeling real good that was a great hit from Goomba. I don't really like Goomba, but that that was pretty solid. Uh, I, I think that, obviously, this is the weakest part of the lineup, you know, Goomba into Paragoomba, especially because Paragoomba does stuff like that. But I do think that Goomba's bat has, like, some merit to it. I still think he's one of the worst characters in the game. Um, but, you know, I, I think that there are worse characters. Look at that. You know, who's making that play? No one. No one makes that. That's a Goomba exclusive. Only Goomba gets that. Low trash for the third freaking time with PD. At least two of those would have been homers. The first one, maybe not. Uh, uh, but honestly, it probably would have because it's PD. Oh, Waluigi's automatic. He's freaking automatic, man. I love this character. But yeah, no, I, uh... That's, that's so sad with PD. Low trajectory three times. Ooh, I thought that would have hit me. Tried to lean into it hard. Honestly, I could probably afford to burn more stars with characters. Did I get a tag here? Was I in time? Yeah, I was. I could probably afford to burn some more stars. Because, like... I have Shy Guy, I have Madge, and then I technically have Wario, but, like... <laughs> I technically have Wario. But I don't really use the Wario star very often, you know? So, I don't know. I don't know, man. Oh, just missed on that one. I would have loved that was a bomb. Oh, unlucky didn't score any there. 14 hits though. We're looking pretty good through six here, and we got a we got the the five innings of shutout baseball from Peach so far, which you love to see. I, I like Peach pitcher a bit. I think uh, I don't think she has like what it takes because it's too hard. I think it's too hard to be deceptive with Peach. I think that generally. Uh, I think that generally, like, with characters like Peach, it's too hard to kind of trick players on that, uh, with the curve, because the ball goes too fast. Um, but you can throw some nasty pitches, so it's less of, like, reactionary and more of, um, oh, I didn't get that. And more of just, like, pick a pitch and hope they don't guess right, uh, with Peach at least. Well, with, like, Dixie Kong and even Boo, you can, uh... You can kind of manipulate it based on where they are. Oh, come on. I can't believe I didn't make that play. No way he's safe at home, right? Yeah. All right. All right. Base is loaded, no outs, and he's already put across a run. That's not That's not great for us. And, and Boomerang, bro, up, looking to tie this game up with one swing of the bat. Lucky for me, just barely gets jammed there. And he sent his runner too early. 
And we got him in a rundown. I I love this position if, if I'm me. Yeah, look at that. That is a double play because he uh, accidentally sent dry bones too early. I think I still would have had him. Or I at least potentially would have. Tries to lean into that one. I think with Mario up, you just got to swing the bat. I understand you load the bases for Boo, but... Mario's got the fireball, and Peach getting out of trouble there. So that was bases loaded, no outs, only one run comes across. You take that any day of the week. Now, I, you gotta burn a Star Wars Shy Guy here, and that's exactly why. Look at that hit. A that, is a, that is a textbook Falcon Pop. Textbook Falcon Pop, and it's free. We got the reimbursement. We mailed it in. You know, not a lot of people do that, but we did, and we got the out for it. Ooh, I wonder if you could have caught that with a better route. I don't know. Route. Probably not. Oh, well. Ugh. I wanted a Shy Guy Homer so bad, this classic, man. I wanted it so bad. that I think it was like the first game we played. I crushed a perfect one and it got wall jumped. Ugh, a tragedy, man. An absolute tragedy. But oh, well. You know, it is what it is. I think that classic mode is the greatest thing that has ever happened in Tomorrow Superstar Baseball. Just like both online and Dinger City. We... Like, classic's fun. It's, it, it's, you get to see every character. Sure, not all these characters are good, but it's nice to see the variety, you know? You get a team that you can stick with and you can root for. Like, like if you're watching, like, obviously, if you're watching my videos, I hope that you're rooting for me, unless you're, like, the person I'm playing. But maybe, maybe you're not. Maybe you're a hater. Maybe you're hate-watching. But either way, you know, it's like... You get a team to root for for Dinger City Classic. It's like you got six unique teams. You grab one that you wanna you wanna stick with. Maybe you like the Toad Brigade. Maybe you like some other stuff. Oh, not the double play. But it's nice. It gives you someone to root for. You get to see every character. It's cool. It's fun. It's it's a nice time. The draft is a great time. Draft streams are always a ton of fun. So yeah, I don't know. I, I love the classic Shy Guy. Look at that. Look at that play from Shy Guy for the star. I probably wouldn't have dove for that if it wasn't a star. But I think it's worth giving up a. Uh, an extra base if it's a star chance that time there was no play but i i think that's worth it to be honest oh let's go fpt at the plate oh walu's not gonna make that one pm really running for that honestly if pm got the ball oh that's some good base running from him some bad throwing from me why am i not throwing at the cutoff there Ooh, that's a that's a cringe throw from mr joe uh-oh uh-oh <laughs> oh, he's done that so many times, man. He's run into so many outs like that. What a hit from uh, from Para. That's definitely going to score uh, Piata. But again, he's running into so many outs. Like, you had to know that once the ball was being thrown to Wario, there was no chance I was throwing home because there's no shot Wario makes that play. I don't know. Back to the top of the lineup, though. Well, second hitter. The two hitter is pretty nice. Uh, two, three, four leadoff is pretty good. You know, say you pitch to PD. Gets on base, gets a uh, gets a home run. Both good scenarios with Waluigi coming up. Obviously, you don't want to get out, but that's uh, that's true of every single uh, every single at bat to ever happen in Mario Baseball ever. So who knows? Oh my god, I forgot to forgot to add the Discord thing up here again. Whoops, that's an L on my part. Oh, Walu. I mean, here you got to swing for the fences, Wario. I, obviously, there's some merit to trying to get your lineup turned over um for like the next inning if you, if you want to just go for like slappies but what's cooler a wario homer or a wario slap it you tell me in the comments you tell me here we go bottom of the eighth we're looking good so far things are feeling nice uh, obviously we're the away team three runs you know anything can happen but we've our offenses look good defenses look good magic Koopa not able to make that play Unfortunately, that's a dry bones lead off double with the star for star. You know, you pay a star, you get the reimbursement. He mailed in his rebate. You should mail in your rebates. That's how they get you. They tell you they're going to give you a rebate and then you just, you don't mail it in. Wario, what are you doing? I think that piece should have been able to make that play. Oh, he got me. Oh, he didn't get me. I got him. Let's go. Um, nice. That's, uh, add that to the, add that to the bolt running himself into outs counter because... Boy, has he done that a lot this game. Probably looks like a totally different game if he didn't run himself into an out like three times. Four times, maybe even. Yeah, easiest walk. Obviously, you're bringing up the uh, 
the tying run in Mario, but he, he's going for a star here. The star likely not going to score two runs. I mean, a really good Mario star might, but I also only have to get two. Oh, that was a bad pitch. He should have swung at that. I think he might have had it. All right, he's got a good eye here. I mean, I have to throw him a strike. And he's going to crush it right at Wario. Can't knock it down. Oh, it was so close, man. So close to knocking it down. That's going to bring in two. Damn, all right. So, uh, like I said, you know, I don't think the Mario Fireball is going to score two. But, but, sometimes you get the nice gapper like that, you know. If it's not hit at a fielder, you definitely look good there. And now the game's tied, just like that. Wow, look at that. Why am I throwing home? What am I doing? Oh, that's got to be a misinput. There's no way I should have thrown home there. And now we're in a whole new ball game, you know? Just like that, the game's all tied. Still get the moonwalks in though. That's crazy, man. That is a that's a tough eighth inning. We were winning 5-0, one in the sixth, one in the seventh, three in the fifth in the eighth to tie it up at five. And then and then Pianta can't get her done. Respect uh I thought about the jump, didn't get it. We do have five stars, you know, so it's not like it's not like we're in the worst spot. If we can kind of move through our lineup here, we're we're looking uh, we're looking at a good situation for the top of a uh, really in a good situation when we get to the top of our lineup. But the bottom of the lineup is not who you want up in the ninth when the game is on the line. And just like that, that is a one-two-three inning. You hate to see it. You really hate to see it. And now we've got a. Uh, the bottom of his lineup, which is actually pretty good for us. You know, if we can get out of this 1-2-3, we're looking to get to the top of the 10th. We do have the bottom of our lineup still with this 8-9 hitters and Peach and Baby Mario, but not the worst thing, and that's a great way to start it off. You have to get these guys out. This is, this is um, this is like, such a big spot where you... Obviously, like, every time you're in a situation like this, you have to get the guy out, but when it's the 8-9 hitters, you cannot be giving up hits to those characters, and luckily for me, I did not. You know, I got through that part of the lineup... Because now you have the top of the lineup with two outs, which is a much better spot to be in than uh, if you had a runner on with one out or even two on, no outs. That's a nightmare scenario with Bones coming up. But really nice execution by me in the bottom of the ninth there. And now we're looking to put up a fat top of the tenth, take the lead back in this game. And it all starts with the Peach leadoff single, baby. That's what we're talking about. She's been pretty good for us in the, in the, uh, in the stretch here the last few games. She, she's looked good. Uh, baby Mario actually has also been pretty good this game specifically uh unfortunately there obviously almost hits into a double play but not quite and now top of the lineup i have five stars obviously i will sink as many stars as i can into this mag at bat and i'm gonna actually stay there at second i would have had third because he dove but there's no reason to risk it with pd coming up pd piranha so capable of putting a home run over the fence but instead going to fly out to center field unfortunately I was late on my timing. It was just bad timing. I have to score here, though. Obviously, this is the guy to do it with. Waluigi, such a good hitter. So capable of scoring this run. We've been automatic with him all freaking game. And it doesn't stop there. We get the dinky little hit into left field for the go-ahead run in the top of the 10th. That's what we're talking about, baby. That is what we're talking about. Last game, I played with Bull went to extras as well, so... I love Garlic Ball. You know, you got to skill check him sometimes. There's two outs, and he went for the wrong one. So that's going to be a double with two RBIs. A triple for Wario. Base clearing, two RBI triple for Wario with the star. That's why we hold on to the stars, man. I burned them all. Boo is tired. So don't even worry about that. And now we got the yellow fellow up. We're feeling amazing. We're feeling great. We're looking to put across another run. Nice little single here from pink, uh, from not pink menace, from yellow fellow. And we're feeling great. And that's that right there. That's a nice RBI double in the gap. The boys are moving. The lineup's turning. It's great stuff for us here in the top of the 10th. We've almost doubled our runs from the entire game here in the 10th. We knocked out Boo. We're feeling great. And you know what? Why not put another one in the gap? That's going to be a nice RBI double for Shy Guy. Another run coming around. And uh, we've almost batted around here. Uh, we had Peach lead off the inning. And here she is on deck. So if we get on with Shy Guy, we won't. All right. Look at that, guys. Look at that. It's never over. It's never over. Five runs in the 10th inning for a commanding 
five run lead in extra innings. You don't see that too often, man. You don't see that too often. So now we're, we're, we're posed to put up that seventh win of the season. Finish up at seven and three would be a really solid performance. Let's see what we can do. He br uh, I bring in Waluigi. You bring in the closer. You got to go with the closer. He gets a nice little weak contact there. Pianta puts it away on a nice diving stop. And we are cruising here in the last game of the season. Five run lead. Two outs to go. Five run lead. One out to go. It's it's a great feeling, you know? Boomerang, bro. Who cares? We pitch to this clown. He's going to pop it up anyway. He's going to pop out. Waluigi just going to pound the zone with fastballs here. Why not? Magikoopa puts it away. Turns his back. That's the game. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. I mean, a solid victory there. 10 to 5 in extras. You don't see that too often. So, really good feeling. I, uh, that's it for the regular season, and then I play Classic, guys. So we're going to have the playoff video coming up. Again, be sure to comment what you think I should do for the video. If I should do, um, if I should do, like, a recap video, or if I should upload the games kind of, like, in this style. Uh, up to you guys. They're getting uploaded either way. So let me know. Thank you again so much for watching the video. Be sure to like, comment, subscribe if you're not already, because we are, uh, we are approaching 4K. 3.9 thousand subscribers. That is awesome. 4K by the end of the month. We're looking it straight in the eye. We're going to do it. Thank you guys so much again for watching, and I'll see you next time.